On your class page, in this case the class page is named Suffolk County, you will see the number of students enrolled in your class. You click Students Enrolled. Here are the names of the students. Since this is a password protected page, you'll see uh, that the students' names are there. You click on the student's name and then you'll get a more detailed summary of their activity on the site. You'll see that they played poker pairs and their score was 1.01 seconds. They played the shopping game and earned a score of 30 seconds. And then you'll see all of the other things that they uh, did on the site. That they looked at their word list, they printed it, they practiced it, and they browsed it. They completed the on the air game and they earned 48 seconds in poker pairs. If you click on another student's name, in this case it's Zoe Zone, you'll see that she earned 40 points while playing cliffhanger. She completed the fishing game. She played the shopping game in 43 seconds and for an audio blog, you'll also see the comment that she left. Back on your class page, to view the activity on this class page, you click View Activity, and here is the gradebook format of Activity Stream. This simply tells you which games the student played based on the icons of the game and then it tells you how many times they played the game or if they played the game. Again, how many times they played the game or if they played the game. And these are the two ways that you can check on the activity of your students on your class page.